Saturday morning, the International Arts Center hosted their monthly Art Spark event. Families from the Troy community were able to come out and participate in different activities, such as creating a 3D portrait, a scavenger hunt, and enjoying snacks and story time. So today is our September Art Spark, which is our monthly free children's event, and where we invite families in the community to come in and create art and explore our exhibits and just spend that time together. Today they're creating a 3D portrait using various materials um, hanging from a clothes hanger uh, and it is based, uh, it's inspired by our, our portrait collective exhibit that we have right now on display in our Hubazu Gallery. Over the past year, ArtSpark has become a well-known event around the city of Troy. The Alabama State Council of the Arts has provided a grant to pay for future ArtSpark events. The event Saturday was the largest turnout of families so far. We've been doing Art Spark for over a year. Um, we started back last year in August, and so slowly we have grown. Over time, more people have come, and uh, people are, I guess, word of mouth and just advertising. We've just had more people show up, so we're excited that this has been our biggest turnout. After the activities inside, families were able to continue the fun outside. Food was provided to feed the fish and turtles okay. in the pond at the Janice Hawkins Park. Art Spark events happen once a month, but events might differ depending on the activities. We have uh, Art Spark once a month. Uh, sometimes it is held in person and sometimes it's pick up packets. So we just ask anyone who's interested to follow our social media and we will send out um, emails just to keep our public informed about whether it's in person or a pick up packet. While the event does provide a fun opportunity for kids to be creative, Jackson believes the event is about more than the activities and projects. We just want to welcome our community into our facility and to know that this is uh, their art center. Anyone is welcome here and we just want all of our children to come play and get more exposure to the arts. You can find out more information about ArtSpark and other IAC events on their Facebook page at International Arts Center. Belle Johnson, Troy, Trojan Vision News.